This conference will now be recorded. On that, on that same subject, um, there uh, years ago we met with Catherine and I met with DO, uh, DOT in there were actually some that we felt that the town could do away with that were not necessary. If you had three in a row and maybe the, the middle one we didn't really need, particularly if you're going to go with LED, would we still have that opportunity when Affinity goes out and around to adjust that um, in areas that yeah. were... You know. So absolutely, if that's it, you can have that conversation with them. That what they will do is go, as I said, go through and check whatever source says um, that we have. They will look at areas where maybe they think um, we don't need lighting, and areas where maybe we need more lighting and come back with a final proposal. Great. But um, Tim has looked at this as well. Mm -hmm. um, looks like a. And I know the other communities, Franklin has done it, other communities around, around have done it. Um, he is, <clears throat> um, Steve Lieber is the gentleman who I've been talking with and more than happy and willing to come in and talk to the board directly if you want him to, to ask him specific questions. Um, but it, uh, we would own the lights. Um, so it looks like it's a good, a good plan. I know when we met with DOT, we crossed off a lot of, um, of ones that we we didn't. They said we owned and we didn't own, and there was a lot of chopping and moving things around. So we got it down pretty well, um, reasonably well, I should say. We didn't wasn't 100 percent back then, and that was about five six years ago, maybe. But it, this does sound like a really good plan because it's going to pay for itself. A few years. So, no. what would the board like to do? Would you like to have him come in in one of your December meetings and hear from him, have the opportunity to ask questions? I did just send this to you on Tuesday, so if you want another week to look at it, or if you're comfortable moving forward, whatever the pleasure of the board is. Well, how would we pay for this if we wanted to go forward with it without having well, to? So one of the uh, one of the items in the proposal is uh, financing plan through another uh, organization that they work with other communities. Tim, I asked him about it, and Tim felt like we didn't need to go down that road. We could, we could do it on our own. So in terms of paying for it, he's left the room, uh, but he feels. You know, would we put in like a warrant article for next year, or we would just put it in the budget? Oh, we would do it this year. I think you probably well. Do it. I mean, right now. So right now we're in um, uh, November. Um, I don't know that we, we could contract before contract the year, though. and I don't know that we have any funds to encumber or to, okay. you know, to sign a contract. Tim's really the one to answer that question, but I'm guessing based on conversations with him and the budget where we are, we probably don't have that right now. So um, it would probably be a budget item, unless okay. you wanted it as one article. No, I'd go with the recommendation or whatever you and Tim said. Okay. Agreed. Agreed. I think it's a worthwhile project, especially if mm -hmm. the payback comes in under three years. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I do too. Yeah, that was it. Absolutely. And the savings that Just, you're going to see. Yeah. Every year. yeah. So I, I, I'll make a motion that we move forward with it in a. I'll second it. Any other discussion? Um, so just approve it without talking to them first or questions? No. Do you have questions, John? Because uh, yeah. I've read it and I. Yeah, I, I did not get a chance to read it all, but I, you know, I was curious about like warranties and, and how much it costs the fees to get them replaced if, you know, they fail. Okay. You know, and, uh, do they use different values of light? Because I know presently, if you approach, like a neighborhood might have dimmer or yellow lights now. And then if you get to like a, um, a busy intersection part, they use brighter lights now. And I don't know if that's how they do it. We can have them come in at your December meeting if you want. I'm, I'm for it. I just want to yeah, get a good idea on what we're Yeah, I'd at. like to know. Yeah, let's have them come in. Ten right. year, ten year Sounds good. Oh, he's got it. 
Is that parts and labor? There's a motion uh, and a second. I'll yeah. withdraw my motion and let him just come in. And I'll withdraw my second. Warranty statement is in this packet. Well, I think um, um, John just hasn't had a chance to look at yeah, it. So. Yeah. yeah. That's I mean, if, if you want. Um, it's okay. No. Well, the question, I'll ask a question. Do, do we need to have him come in, or if we develop questions, can we send those questions to him? Yes. Then have him answer. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. It's, I mean, it's, so, so, so if yeah. you want, um, if you have any questions, I can give you his email directly, or you can send them to me, and I will send them. He's very responsive, um, and get the answers to those questions, and then you can, if you're comfortable, vote in it, vote on it at your December meeting. If before then the answers you get you're not comfortable, let me know and he's ready to come in at, at that meeting. Sounds like a plan. Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, the second one under your the second bullet under your FYI, how did that turn out? So uh, the chief did go to Northfield and they were not ready to make a decision. They asked him to come back and give them a presentation by the end of this month. So they have not made any decision yet. They still want more information or want a presentation from him. So So they want the fourteen thousand dollars from the town of Tilton specifically? Well, so two. what they want. That's it's just yeah, a two. separate as a separate thing from everything else. Um, so it's fourteen thousand dollars for each ventilator. Yeah. And the chief had asked because there's another ARPA fund available, this locality equipment fund, had asked if the town of Tilton would uh, consider because the district cannot apply for it if Tilton would. And my question back to him was, well, what's Northfield doing? And he said, I don't know. I'm going to talk to them. And I said, well, the board wants to hear what they have to say before they decide. And he he still doesn't have an answer from them. He expects that at the end of the month. Uh, but you'll see in my notes to you that the application period is, is open until June of um, next year. So it's not like you have to make a decision. It, but my understanding is that all he's asking for is one of the municipalities to apply for the $28,000 so that he can receive two ventilators. Am I under that? Is that you, correct? You, you are exactly right. And it's right. up of funds, you are so it's no monies to the town. You are exactly right, but however, okay. um, those... Uh, is a 10 match. There is a 10% match. Oh, um, okay. There is a 10% match, but, but more than that, Tim and I had already talked about a use for those funds here in, in the town. I thought you said it was a separate. It is a separate. A sep but it does, we, we have a place for that money in that category in town, what is what you're saying? Yes. Other there, than the ventilators? Yes. Okay, got it. I see what you're saying. And so because it's the, the application period doesn't close until June of next year, we're not in any rush. And, you know, mm -hmm. maybe Northfield comes back and says, no, we're going to do it. And you may say, okay, we'll fund 10, you know, 10% 10 of one ventilator. Or you may say, we'll fund 10% of two. So. I get it. Are these ventilators through the place faulty ventilators or Sass ventilators, or uh, I, I think it's, they're up, a, it's an upgrade. So upgrade. ventilators. Yeah. So doesn't go in their budget. Uh, oh, one other item that was in my action items that just came up. So we have a flexible spending account through uh, that is available to our employees through Health Trust. Mm -hmm. and right now, the maximum <clears throat> that they can um, have deducted is $2,600. That that uh, is going to increase in the next year up to 
if the maximum is 2750, we have the ability to, uh, it's 2850, 2850 versus 2600. So the question to you is, would you like to uh, make that available to the employees? Absolutely. It's no cost oh, to the town. It's yeah, I yeah. should not, I'm sorry. No. I, I, I need to recuse myself on that decision because I'm, I'll be a recipient of it. Yes, so. yes, I think it would be good to offer mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Uh, and the last question I have for you on my report uh, is Christmas parade. Are you all going to want to participate? Do you want a truck in the parade? Does Kevin need to decorate the truck? Would Kevin you? Is here. Would you do that for us? Warm well, enough, can I ride this way? <laughs> I'm in. I'll, I'll, do, I'll dress up as Santa and ride my motorcycle. It's warm enough. <laughs> got to keep the salt off the roads. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> state road, you got to talk to the state, not him. Oh. So yeah. that, that ain't We have contacts. Yeah. We have contacts. But there's already a Santa in the parade, so you so, may get confused. I'll, I'll just be the Grinch on the motorcycle. Man. No, that would be better. <laughs> Yeah, put a little dog on the front on the handlebars. So I'm good. <laughs> All right. Any questions for me? I did have a question, but I forgot it. So while you're thinking about it, I just want to circle back to the questions relative to the LED lighting. Can we put a date on that um, when you will give me those questions that I can send to Steve? Um, because if, if we're going to have him come in, I'd like to have all those questions to him to find out if you're satisfied with the answers, because then if you're not, then we want to bring them in. I'd, I'd After the weekend. include them in the emails with them, the two of them, and let them ask the questions. And just Who's the two? Scott and Joan. I don't think so. Did Which I did. I know I did. Yeah. I just I wanted to. Yeah. Why do you say get the questions to you by 12 through Monday? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Lunch Monday. All right. Perfect. Perfect. Does they have the weekend to review it? Absolutely. And the Patriots are on this weekend, so they're on tonight at 8.20, three hours and 10 minutes. Tim, since you're here, the question came up about this proposal for the LED lighting. Yes. And uh, it was, how, how <clears throat> would we proceed with this? I don't imagine this is something that's going to happen this year, or even if it did, that we had the funds to encumber to pay for the 55000 So would we put it in the budget for next year? Um, either that or it could be a Warner article okay. uh, too, but but um, uh, I plan to look at that also because I want to look at the justification and see what rate they were using uh, for the justification. Uh, and they were also looking for some other um, polls that we have. Oh, you didn't? I haven't had a chance to, to get it for it. There's a, there's a handful. There's, okay. There's, and um, they were looking three, for information. Three or four it. others that we have. Okay. So I'll send that up to them. Okay. Good. Mm -hmm. that, I am. Wow. Non public? Non public. All right. Are we still on the 40 minutes? No, no we're, all, we're all set. No, I'm, we're still on the 40 minute mark here. So, <laughs> Patriots. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, I make a motion to enter non public session for RSA 91 A colon 3, Roman numeral 2 A. The dismissal, promotion, or compensation of any public employee or the discipline of such employee or the investigation of any charges against him or her unless the employee affected, one, has a right to a public meeting, and two, request that the meeting be open, in which case the request shall be granted. RSA 91-A, colon 3, Roman numeral 2, B, the hiring of any person as a public employee. We expect to be back in the non-public session at approximately midnight, 7.30. Do I have a second? Second. second. Multiple seconds. Roll call vote. Constantino, yes. Jessamine, yes. Pyra, yes. Ruggles, yes. Scanlon, yes. We are non-public session at 5.11. This conference will now be recorded. The time being 8.28 p.m., I'd like to make a motion to seal the minutes of the non-public Minutes of November 18th, 2021, because the reasons justifying the need for the non-public session still remain. Second. Motion is second. Any discussion? 
All those in favor say aye. 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 Motion passes. Any new business to come before the board this evening? Joe has something. Joe, you know, I was thinking about you. Is there anybody else who needs to go first? Motion to adjourn. Motion second. To, motion to second. All those in favor say aye. 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 We are adjourned. Uh, opposed? We are adjourned <laughs> at 829. Opposed?